Hey guys, welcome to another video. This is Marvel Legends Maximum Venom. I don't even know what Maximum Venom is because I haven't seen the, uh, you know, the whatever series that they came out with. But I do know of Maximum Carnage. I mean, that was like a game from like Super Nintendo, right? But anyways, we have the Miles Morales, Maximum Venom, Spider-Man, and obviously really, really cool figure. Let me go back here. So this is the back, and essentially that's what it looks like. We got the Carnage uh, figure over there, and we have the Carnage figure here, and Venom there. So let's take a look at the figure, or we're gonna unbox it, and then we'll take a look at the figure. But anyways, what is here is that you have, um, you know, an extra fist for the Venom pool, and you have a fist, or I guess the arm. One of the arms, the right one or the left one, I don't really know. You have Miles Morales as the, I don't know, I think he is infected with the Venom symbiote or, you know, the Carnage one, I don't really know. But anyways, uh, let's unbox it and then we will take a look at it. Alrighty, so what we have here is the figure itself and you know, it doesn't come with anything. I noticed that, you know, most of the figures don't come with anything or the, I guess the Carnage one didn't come with a lot anyways. But uh, you have, you know, Venom Pool's arm, right? I think this is the left arm and it is huge. I mean, it's as big as this figure. I mean, this thing is crazy. I mean. Hell, I can't believe the arm is so big, but I guess it's the size of Venom, the other Venom. Anyways, Venom Pool, really cool character. A uh, fusion of Deadpool and Venom. All right, so anyways, here's the fist as well. But I, I don't know, there's really nothing to look at here. I mean, it is what it is, right? And then you have Miles Morales. This is the one, I guess, let me read a bit from the the box, you know, there is actually a bit, you know, a little um, tidbit saying something. So anyways, let's see if you can focus in. When the Venom symbiote attaches to Miles Morales, he gains extreme new powers. That's all it says, you know, and there's the figure. And that's the actual live figure. So here it is. Let me zoom in a bit more. Let's see if I could get, give you a... There you go. That is amazing view. All right, so there is the figure. And, you know, it has new arms, or I guess the the uh, wrists or whatever, you, the hands. And down here, I guess you got the claws thing going. Let me just bring in the Miles Morales, other one. So here's Miles Morales, and here's the Venom symbiote Miles Morales. As you can see, this one's much darker, right? I guess it's because of the fusion between the Venom symbiote kind of makes it a bit purplish. Here's the back. All right, you can feel like there are veins here, right? So that's something that, that is actually something that is new. You, you actually didn't even see those until this line of Marvel Legend figures, right? Especially with the Carnage one, you could actually really feel it. Like mostly these things are like, you know, painted on, but here you can actually see that it's embossed kind of. So that's pretty cool. Especially here, you can see it there. All right, so, you know, you got the, the hands going there, right? And he kind of looks like the lizard. I don't know. Let's put him down and we'll see and, you know, we'll see more about it compared to the other 
uh, characters I have here. All right, so here is the the figure, and right next to him is Miles Morales. Well, actually, they're both Miles Morales. It's just that you know, one of them had the Venom symbiote, and while the other one doesn't. All right, so let's talk a bit about them both. I mean, obviously, they're the same character, and here are the major differences. Let me zoom out a bit so you can see the legs. So, down here, as you can see, there's the red markings. There's nothing here. I mean, they, they, this actually looked like claws, right? So, his suit is entirely black here. This one's kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of purplish black, right? So, you know, there's a hint of purple there. And I guess I get kind of why the uh, the uh, fingers is red, right? Because, it, you know, his suit is red here. And let's see, what else do we have? Symbol has changed, definitely. The, um, other than that, I don't think other, you know, that it changed that much. Other than the color and the legs and the, the hands, right? Other than that as well, so the veins coming out and then his crazy teeth. You got like Miles Morales. Let me spin him around. I don't know if you can actually, he will stand. No, oh, well, he stood. All right, so back here. This symbol actually looks very similar. I mean, they, they look pretty much the same. Let me see if I can zoom in to show you guys. So there's a symbol for that one. And there's a symbol for that one. So it looks very, very similar, right? Except. I guess this is the uh, Into the Spider-Verse version. Well, that's why there's a splash of paint there. You notice that? But everything else pretty much looks the same. Well, you know, aside from the major differences. All right, so as we're looking at this figure a bit more, I'm gonna talk more about it. I've noticed one thing that is different. I missed this entirely. I didn't I didn't even see it at first, right? Let me zoom in. But you notice that the uh, the wrist here, there's that thing. That is new. That is definitely new. I mean, obviously it looks really cool like this, but um, like I was saying, the wrist, that, that thing coming out there, that's not something that uh, I was used to seeing. But um, here he is. And he stands pretty well because his feet is pretty much, you know, it's it's pretty big compared to other feet. Let me see if I can get it, him in here. Anything else? I don't know. I mean, it feels like he's very similar to, you know, the, the original Miles Morales. But, of course, he has the Venom symbiote, which makes him kind of crazy. I want to see if I can replace his head or something. But, you know, he doesn't come with a new head or anything. He comes with pretty much the Venom Pool stuff, and that's all that is there, right? All right, so we got him in this pose here with kind of Venom Ballet, even though I'm not even sure if that is possible, but it looks pretty cool.